Okay, so I think this might be my last night. Um, if I make it through this to the next day, I will have broken my record, I think. Um, if I make it through this, I want to give you guys a walk around my base. I've built just uh, pretty much as, uh, as much as I possibly can. The enemies are now spawning in the traps, so I don't think building any more makes any sense at this point. So what I'll do is I'll just give you guys a little walk around the base once we make it through this. So let's see how this goes. All my tools are fully upgraded. Most of those were provided to me by Wisps. Let's see, I'm not, I'm not using my bow. Let's see how things go. I'm just gonna stand here and see how close these guys get. Oh, this one's getting a little, these ones are getting a little close. Making me kind of nervous up here in the upper left corner. Let's see, I think you, I think that, sh that one should get taken out. These ones are the ones making me nervous right here. <clears throat> there we go. So this will be, this will be a new record for me. I just made a new record. So the problem I'm having is this, uh, this barrier here, this, this, um, this little wall here is is eliminating the range of a lot of my ballistas over here. These reinforced ballistas are unable to reach a lot of these, so they pile up and start surging around this corner. But everything else seems to be working all right, man. I, I'm super happy to be recording this, as this is my this is my record run. So I do everything incredibly symmetrical. Um, I did uh, I did these while I had the stone. I don't know if you see how much stone I have now. 342. These are from these late night wisps. They start giving a lot more resources. So um, I started, I ran these barbed wires until I ran low on stone. Then I started running these little uh, wooden spiky pits to slow them, uh, slow the enemies down. And then uh, once I started running low on wood resources, I just started building these mud pits. Anything that I could do to, um, to slow the, the creatures down as my turrets work on them. So this is pretty much what it looks like. I even went around this little lake over here let me hide that again. And um, yeah, this is pretty much it. And very symmetrical. Everything perfectly ringed. Um, each of the ballistas has seven cogs, one steam engine. I designed this in a way that every single one of these ballistas is touched by a steam engine. The shrine has two steam engines and um, <clears throat> uh, six windmills. So that, uh, that makes the most optimal damage per second with a range of 24, so the shrine can reach every single one of the corners of the base. And then the rest of these have just their base level of 18 range, which is more than enough to reach um, at least halfway through the base and a little bit more so they can help each other. So here we go, five, four, three, two, and one. I think what I'll do is I'll head into this upper corner and see if I can help out the help out the turrets a little bit. I, I don't. I mean, at this point, the arrows are not doing much at all. So um, I'm just gonna pretend. I'm just gonna stand up here and pretend to help out a little. Yeah, they're gonna they're gonna come surging around this corner in just a moment, and there's nothing I can do about it. Now, hopefully the other turrets will finish up with the work that they have to do and then be able to assist the ones over here, but I'm not, not real confident on it. Oh yeah, you see how like once they get through that, uh, that, that barbed wire, wire, they really start to surge. But now the other turrets are finishing up so they can focus their energy over on this corner and help out a little. Oh guys, I think I might make it through night 71. This is like, not only have I beat my record of night 68, I think I've gone two over at this point. Oh my God, guys, I did it, I did it. Well, there's not much more I can build, so why not? Let's just go ahead and skip this day. I mean, shoot, let's just get into it. See how far this, how far I can ride this. This is amazing. Oh my God, here we go. Wow, look at those guys. They've got 12,000 health at this point. Oh my God. There's no way. I don't think I'm, I, I just, I don't think I'm making it through this night. I just don't see it happening. But anything is possible. Oh my God. 
Oh my god. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Don't let this guy through. Don't let him through. Don't let him through. Oh no, once he gets past that fence, it's over. Oh, fudge. Okay, okay, okay. Uh-oh, uh-oh, I see some down below that are getting close. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, okay, good, good, good. They finished their work. Oh man, they're starting to surge. Oh, I'm getting a little excited. I think I might... Can I make it? Can I get through 972? Is this really gonna happen? Is this really happening right now? All right, I'm trying to help out my turrets a little bit. I mean, I know my arrows aren't doing much at this point, but uh, anything I can do to try to make this happen, let's see. Come on, okay. Oh my God, oh my God, this is happening, guys. This is happening. <gasps> no way. No way, no way, no way, no way. Oh my God, no way. Oh, I forgot to mention, there's a little barrier right here as well that's, uh, that's really interfering with the range of my turrets. Well, guys, again, there's not much more I can build, so you know what? I, I'm just gonna go for it again. Let's, oh my God, I cannot believe this. Here we go, here we go, next night. Wow, they are coming with 16,000 health at this point. Oh, this is just not even, uh, come on, come on, there, no. Man, that's just not even fair. There's just no way. There's no way. This is it, guys. This is it. He's broken through. He's coming fast. Oh my... Okay, hold on, hold on. Let's see, let's see. I'm, guys, I'm just gonna stay here in the middle and shoot at whatever comes closest. And right now, it's this guy over here. I wish I had more vis visibility down to the south and to the north, but I don't. So, oh, 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 here they come, here they come. Guys, I think... Oh, I think this is a wrap. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, 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 Help! <laughs> oh my god, this is actually happening. Oh, no, 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 this is... Sophie, I'm recording. Oh my god, I can hear your voice. No way, no way, no way, no way. No way, this is... I think I might be able to make it another night. I think I might make it through 73. <gasps> no way, no way, no way, no way, no way. Oh my god. Oh, yeah, this is happening. This is happening. This is happening. <laughs> There's no way I make it through night 74. There's just no way. Okay, guys, I had a little bit of a panic attack because I just realized I was running out of space on my C drive. It was literally at 99, like it was full, full, full. And I was afraid I was gonna lose this recording. So in case the other one didn't work out, because I still haven't previewed that yet, I gave a little walk around the base, um, showed everybody what's going on here at, on my base in uh, Outpost, and described a little bit what, about what it was going on. I've broken my record by three nights at this point. My last record was 68, night 68. Um, I've now got through... I've now got through night 73. I'm probably not gonna make it through night 74. I'm like almost 100%. So I was freaking out a little bit on the last video. I'll try to combine that. I'm just gonna do one more run around my base before I run out of time and the night time arrives, just so you guys can get an idea of what's going on. I'm a little bit worried right now because I'm not seeing the recording icon so the overlay is not showing over top of outcat out, outpost at this moment. So I'm a little worried you guys might not be seeing my record night. So I'm gonna pop in here and take a quick screenshot um, with, uh, with Steam just so I can have a record of this, at least one freaking photo of it. So here we go guys. I'm gonna run over here. We've got 108 seconds. You guys can get a little idea of what's going on with my base. I've got uh, six windmills and two steam engines surrounding the shrine so it can reach every single one of these traps. And each of the ballistas is surrounded by seven cogs and one steam engine, very evenly distributed. Ran around doing these barbed wires until I ran out of stone, then switched over to doing the sticky traps and then the mud pits. So this is perfectly symmetrical, goes completely around the base. Do, 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 do. I have all, the, all full, fully upgraded tools, uh, all void level. 
uh, those void tools. Most of them, I paid for probably about half of them, and then the Wisps brought me the rest of them. At this point, the Wisps are bringing me so much uh, goodies that I just I don't even need to harvest at this point. I'm, I'm just done building because the baddies are now spawning within the traps. They, they, they're not spawning outside, so it just doesn't make any sense to keep building. So um, I have that, uh, that one talent that allows you, the more energy you have, the more damage your bow does. Uh, at this point, there's just nothing I can do. The, they're spawning last round with 16,000 HP. Uh, and it's just like, there's no way. I, I mean, there's, just, uh, there's, there's a limit to how far this can go. But uh, I think we're getting ready to see what's gonna happen here. This little barrier right here is causing a bottleneck and then a surge as they spill around this, uh, this corner over here. Same thing with this bottle, body of water. I don't have enough turrets over here to keep putting enough DPS on those guys. So they're starting to surge in. And then the other thing is this barrier right here. So we've got 10, nine guys. You, you, this is gonna be the last run. This is my record, man. Day 74, here we go. 342 stone, and here we go. Now, I'm gonna help out the turrets the best I can, but uh, there's only so much, like 20,000 health they're spawning with. No way, there's just no way. There's just no freaking way. So uh, I'm just gonna shoot at whatever comes into sight. This is absolutely fruitless, hopeless, but I think you guys are gonna enjoy watching this. I, I'm. Pretty happy with the design I have laid out here. It seems to be working. Okay, here he comes surging around. Oh, and look, the other one over here at this other body of water down to the southwest is also a big issue where they're bursting around that. Oh no, oh no, guys. Oh no, let me get out of this guy's way. I don't want y'all to think I'm cheating here. Oh no, oh no, oh no, he's touching the stride. Oh, 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 oh. Oh no, that's one level off the shrine. Oh no, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh no, 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 guys. Oh no, guys, this is done, this is done, it's over, it's over. Here they come. Oh no, <laughs> game over, guys. Oh no, <laughs> oh man, guys, that's the farthest I've gotten. I beat uh. Night 73, new record. You can see the new record here. 11 million experience, that's the most I've ever seen. Let's see, what have I unlocked? I'm always gonna crap the, uh, toss that as soon as I get to the crafter. All right, we've got trap damage, bow health, all garbage, nothing, nothing I want right there. Let's see, seven free wood, I could care less about that. Okay, turret, wisp. I already have something like that. So the things I just got, eh, they don't really benefit me much. I think with this design, I may have some luck on chapter two. I think I have enough confidence. I wanna give chapter two a run. Try to see if I can speed up that X XP earnings. So let's continue, let's see. I wanna show you guys real quick what I have on my character. So I've got the plus two turret damage. I've got a few extra rune stones spawning, build from any distance and the minus 23 minion health. Um, the chance not to use energy, build from any distance, so we got build, build, and then gather from any distance. Uh, another plus two turret, turret damage, 80% spawn rate on chests. Um, another plus two turret damage, so that's two, four, six, and eight turret damages. Um, and then this four turret armor penetration is like god tier, man. That, that uh, on chapter one, will penetrate anything's armor. The maximum armor they have is four armor, so this goes through everything. Uh, gather from any distance, maximum energy. Okay, those are, those are nice to have, but not must-haves. So now I have 160% um, chest spawn rate. So I get a lot more extra chests each playthrough. The other turret damage, wisp move toward you, and the gather from any distance. Having the wisps move toward you is pretty beneficial as well. It saves you time from having to chase them down and. Later in the nights, it, uh, it's really cool when you're when you're more focused on the base building. So that's where I'm at, guys. As far as talents go, I've got everything down to the black tier, or whatever this is, um, on just about everything. I haven't bothered with these like night skip things. I haven't. I still don't understand the value in skipping nights. Like you kind of need all the resources you gather on those other nights. I don't know if it drops you in with more resources or what. The only thing I'm missing, guys, on red tier is the energy infuser. Fishmaster, um, bow damage, let's see, I've got, uh, you know what, 
oh man, I really need to save up and get this one. But this, this is, uh, increase the quality of item rewards by 35%. That sure would be nice. Um, I've got the, where, where's the XP? The XP is all, uh, da, 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 da. let's see. Uh, okay, here's the XP. So quick learn, okay, experience is all the way down here, 140% more XP. That is really helpful to have. That, that definitely accelerates things in earlier nights. But the fishing spots, man, the fishing spots are really handy to have, especially if there's very few of them, to absolutely guarantee that you get as many buffs as possible. I think that's probably what I'm gonna buy. I, could, I don't use the bow very much at all, so that, that bow, those bow bonuses don't benefit me much. Um, again, the energy infuser, I'm not really interested in that. Wisps, I guess, would be nice. I mean, maybe that'll speed up the gains, but I definitely think early game, this fishing uh, fishing talent is a whole lot more useful. Um, at this moment, well, you know, man, this enemy's moving 42% slower during the winter. Oof, that... Wow, that really might be worth it. So a lot of people are re-rolling when they load in to get a wintertime map. So that, that, that seems to be the way to get the highest scores or the highest nights. I usually play any old map that I'm given, um, but uh, just so happened that today I'm on a winter map. Um, oh man, this I'm really torn between either the 42% slower during the winter or the... Fishing spawn spots by 180%. Man, they cost the same too, so I can... Oh, no, no, no. They don't cost the same. Can I get both? I'm not that great with math. Let's see. I'm going to go for the more expensive one. Fish matters. Yeah. I am 2 million short on those ice crystals. So one more playthrough. I'll get those ice crystals. Man, I think with those, I might be, I might be ready to break a new record, guys. Like, oh my god, I cannot believe that just happened. But yeah, with that, with that um, even slower, so right now they're at 37. Yeah, that's not a huge jump there, 37 to 42, whereas this, this jumped 30%. So yeah, I think that was definitely a good spend. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching the video. If you've watched this far, um, thanks for sharing in my excitement, and uh, hope you enjoy playing some Outpost.